Alright guys, Marshall here and welcome to my first Ultimate Team episode of Track to the Top. I'll be showing you in this episode my journey to number one in Division 1. I'll start off by using this nice little hybrid team. Got some powerhouses at back and Kaylini Dede. A bit of pace at right back, full back, which is what you need really. And then uh, in the midfield got Lamella, El Shawari, Inla, Kagawa and Young. Lamella is definitely the star of this team. I mean, he's so underrated, he's just a 77, but he's got 5 star skills. And the guy has got a fucking rocket on his left foot. Right, so let's get into the season. I won't be starting in Division 4, because that was just a walkthrough, so I will be taking this one from Division 3. And the first guy we get matched up against is Guaglioni. He's got a Napoli badge, Napoli kit, he's called Napoli. He's only got one Napoli player, which I find a bit bizarre. But he's went for Pace and the Walcotts. Far fans of Pedro's, but as everyone knows, even though Pace plays a massive part in this game, Pace isn't everything, and I take a nice little lead here through Papu. I think what he's missing is, uh, he's only got about 70 chemistry, I think it was. But chemistry plays a massive part in this, if you don't have the chemistry, it's just a massive uphill battle, so it's always a good start getting yourself 100% chemistry. Getting your team nicely gelled, and should be... Not straightforward, but it should be easier for you then. As you see there, about the second goal for just a normal header. Nothing really right home about there. His second goal is terrible defender by him. Lofted over the top by Gokan in one. <laughs> Flick it over his keeper somehow. I'm not sure how the hell I did that. I just walk it into the empty net. I didn't just walk it in a few step overs. It would probably majorly piss me off if someone did that to me. And <laughs> as you'll see in a second, it majorly pissed this guy off. As soon as these replays are finished, he immediately presses start and fucks it off. And that is the end of that. Now I can go into the second game. Now this guy looks a lot more organised than the last opponent. So he's got the Menes, he's went for the Leti, he's went for the League 1 team. He's got an absolute prick at centre mid though, and it's that prick that gets him off to a good start. Takes around a few of my players, it's a good passing move from him in fairness. Gets into Joey Barton. And he's the one that whips it in for Menes of all people. I don't know what Menes is doing in that cross, but Giolini should have been doing a much better job in challenging for the header because that was just terrible. And he gets another goal here. <laughs> it's that man, Joey Barton again. Don't think he meant to lay it off there. I think he meant to cross it, but still a good finish. Nice little finesse into the corner. And now I'm up against it. But I do get a goal back. El Shawari takes it down the wing here. Whips it in and Kagawa bags his first ever goal from there with a nice little header into the side of the net. There's no chance for the keeper saving that. And straight from kickoff in the second half, and it takes us a second half to equalise. Don't know what this guy's doing here. I just dispossess him and he just holds it here. You should never hold it in the box. I'll just walk past here and tap it into the corner, which is exactly what I do. And the comeback is on. And that's the equaliser from Kagawa and he's second of the game. And it won't be his last. This guy comes straight back into it. Nice little through ball there. No one's catching the vets unless I've got that bronze centre back, I think he's called Wine from the US. That's a good finish. Um, again, poor on my point, I think. It should have been more organised defensively, but I don't mind as long as I can score more goals than the opponent. And this is obviously a high scoring match. And straight from the kickoff, he should be a bit doing better defensively. Nice little over the top through ball and Kagawa bags his hat trick. Don't know what he's doing there, but it's just an easy finish. And it sets up the game nicely. And I honestly think I can go on and win it from here. Obviously, it's 3 3. It was 3 2 down, I was 2 0 down. Now I have to get the next goal, and that's exactly what happens. Nice little passing move from myself. Gives it to El Shawari. Comes inside of it. Nice little one-two with Kagawa. Who rolls a defender. And places in the corner for his fourth for the game. That's the most the midfielders have scored for me on this game, so pretty pleased with that. But then this guy just goes straight down the run through ball. And he for the sweatiest thing of all. Nice little cutback. Thought he fucked it up, but... The keeper should be saving that. And that is how the game finishes. 4-4. As ever, if you enjoyed, drop a like, leave a comment. 
give us some feedback on the series and I will catch you next time.